Hello everybody and welcome to my 11th Microsoft Access Queries tutorial and this tutorial is going to show you how to use uh, an uh, append query. Um, so again I've just got a, a new customers table um, which I'm using as a holding table um, until I've double checked them so this is going to be where the new customers go and then when I've agreed that they'll be a customer then they'll get added into the customers table. Um, rather than before where it was a suggestion to a change of name this is for an entirely new entry so rather than going into this table and updating it it wants to add new customers into this table so if we go into our queries and start a new one and then select design view um, and close this off then we're going to go into query and then we want to do an append query the first thing it's going to ask you to ask you is what table you want to append to so I want to append to the customers table click OK okay and then I want to show the new customers table um, and then I want to add in to the other table all of the entries from the new customer table so I'll just click the star to do all and review this it's going to show me what customers are going to be added into the table so I'm happy with all them so I click on run click on yes and then it's going to append all of those three um, so if we go into our customers table you'll see that Jason, Sarah and Tina have all been added in along with adding their city name in as well and then because this table holds an auto number it's also assigned them a customer ID automatically um, if I go in and save this query now um, so let's actually find the query uh, get rid of that here we are, so if I save this uh, and call it add new, okay, uh, I can run this as many times as I like, so if I add this, click yes, click yes, and then that's going to add in another three customers called Jason, Sarah and Tina that all live in London as well. So you have to be careful because it's not going to remember that you've already added them in, um, you can just keep adding them in over and over again. Um, and keep going um, and then that will have added loads in there um, so let's just delete them out so delete um, so that's how you use a append query um, you'd probably want to use in combination with a delete query that I'll show you in uh, two tutorials time um, in the next tutorial I'm going to show you how to use a create table query uh, so thanks for listening and I hope to catch you in the next tutorial.